Kanayo O Kanayo shared a video on his Instagram page which has generated mixed reactions. He showed the moment he beat Edoche and other Nollywood celebs, including Chidi Mokeme and Nosares, made a grand entry into an event and walked straight to greet the all new of Ife Obadeyeyeni Tsongusi. However, not everyone was happy at the powerful Tespians at the might that they usually have in the Nolly movies on full display. They greeted the only with handshakes. Yes. Meanwhile, a man that toyed so hard to end this glory and respect, one nonsense son choose to destroy it because of a, a puna. Uh, and the point now is that a uh, I felt like I was watching a movie how a very powerful Hollywood actor Pete Edochi greeted Oni of Ife as an event and the issue is that somebody is saying that uh, how did he greet the person has sent a uh, missed reactions well when you hear Okutu to Ikeneze now you understand it I felt I was watching a movie Pete, Pete's charisma is something else a man that toyed so hard to hand his glory and respect. One nonsense son. Okay, his son chose to destroy it because of a okay. The blame is on the owner of Ife for going to that kind of place and for also accepting a handshake from people. I am not against the Nollywood stars, but they're supposed to bow before the stool of the king of Ife. If it was the former owner of Ife, who could try this and even give him and she that was said you not even see him mm. you won't see him in that kind of environment they gave the oba a three and shake which is how great men and traditionally greeted in eagle land do you expect chief pete edoshi to prostrate for the obas not done we are ndibu please always respect traditions this is disrespectful to our culture your culture when a tinubu when there was an event where tinubu was sitting down it was even the man the Oba that stood up. You are saying your culture, really? <laughs> I visited different palaces in the east during the course of a project I was working on. And each time I went to greet the Igwe, I would ask to prostrate like an Omoluabi. Surprisingly, the Igwe always would decline because it is not their culture. The chiefs would gently ask me to stand up and greet. Introduce yourself and sit down. What a culture shock. But that is their tradition. So before you walk with your head instead of your legs, ask yourself certain questions. Was only on his palace sitting on his stool when this happened? Secondly, are the people in question from the same culture? Is a idol uh, is idobale prostrate always a sign of genuine respect? For is only a king of the two veteran actors? Was this event in Ife? I understand that only is a king too some kings in yoruba land and even a recognized first class king in yoruba land and if and i meet him anywhere my chest will be on the floor i don't expect my Igbo brothers to do the same except when it is a palace when we travel around and experience different cultures our exposure and ways of thinking will change and that is it it looks like this king doesn't even know what his culture expects of him i'm still thinking that that man in Nigeria who shake hands with the great Oba of Benin in that manner. Even the president and other world leaders bow before him. Sorry to say, Peter Edochi just disrespected the king. If you don't respect yourself, no one will. If the real and former kings of the seat is nonsense of seat, this nonsense will not happen. I respect the work and talent of the legend, but if the king starts respecting the throne, and act like a king this madness will not happen if anything remove your cap mm. well the king is not proud he knows he is not good keep your bowing down to god alone this is cultural relativity you don't expect peter Dochi, who is also a well accomplished chief and title holder to bow before the honor we are talking about this if uh, somebody, if uh, you go man call, you think he will be buying that, use now the evil ambassador will be bad now because it's not his culture. He will just greet you and just move on. 
Stop arguing. Oni of Ife is a simple man. If you notice, the Oni was the first to stretch his hand. Yeah, he can never greet the Sultan of Sokoto in this manner. Oni should never, should never himself, he respects himself as well. Only Yoruba land, someone will mess all the community. Co- mess all the community. We said, Baba Pele Pele. Sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. Try it in Nibbo land. You will see, even, even though it is your child, my brother. The eyes of the child will use to look yourself a he go no alpha. If you observe the Oba the reaction, he was so excited to see Pete and Doche as the occasion. Look at his body language and gestures closely. Pete is older than him, a big masquerade and an uh, enigma in his own characteristics. So expecting him to bow is abnormal. This issue shouldn't have been brought up for any reason. And people will want to talk now. People won't talk, they won't talk their own, so you don't even need to blame them. The king is the, is the one disrespecting himself. Must he be anywhere, everywhere? Someone don't even know the meaning of the post they are. They can't even greet him like that in his palace. They can only do that outside. Bowing for God or words. This is nothing but at least Peter Edoshi should have little sleep his head. Why she kill him? <laughs> I love in Chinese. You guys are so cheap these days. I can't even believe what my hair is hearing. The mere fact that Peter Duchi was standing while Oni was seated should tell these morons that the so called respect the crave for has been accorded him. Oni, I can see that some Yorubas have no sense anymore. So, guys, let's say your opinion and have your take on this. So good.